Chapter Review Buyers distinguish between value and price. Value is what the buyers get. Price is what the buyers pay. The benefit or value that a person receives from consuming one, one more unit of a good or service is its marginal benefit. Marginal benefit can be measured as the maximum price that people are willing to pay for another unit of goods and service. The demand curve tells us this price. A demand curve is a marginal benefit curve. The demand curve shows the value measured in terms of price consumer places on each unit of goods and services. The demand curve shows the maximum price willingly paid, it is marginal benefit, for a given quantity. Consumer supply is equal to marginal benefit from a good or service, which is also the maximum price a consumer is willing to pay, minus price paid for it or the current market price. The total benefit is equal to amount paid, you can see from the blue rectangle in the figure, plus consumer surplus, that is green triangle. The consumer surplus is therefore is equal to total benefit minus amount paid. The consumer surplus is the area of triangle that is base times height over 2. Practice problem. Figure 1 shows the demand curve for DVDs and the market price of a DVD. The first question is, what is the willingness to pay for the 20th DVDs? Calculate the value of 10 DVD and the consumer surplus on the 10th DVD. The willingness to pay for the 20th DVD is the price on the demand curve at 20 DVDs which is $1.15. The value of the 10th DVD is its marginal benefit which is also the maximum price that someone is willing to pay for it. In figure 2, the value of the 10th DVD is $1.20. The consumer surplus on the 10th DVD is its marginal benefit minus the price paid for the DVD which is $1.20 minus $1.15 is equal to $1.05 that is the length of the green arrow in figure 2. What is the quantity of DVDs brought? Calculate the consumer surplus, the amount spent on DVDs and the total benefit from the DVDs brought. The quantity of DVDs brought is 20 a day at price 15. And the consumer supplies is base time height over 2, that is the area of the triangle, which is 20 is the base, 10 is the height, that is 25 minus 15 over 2 is equal to $100, that is the green triangle in figure 2. The amount spent on DVD is $15 times the total quantity purchased it is 20 which is dollar 30 price times quantity which is the area of the blue rectangle in figure 2 the total benefit is the amount spent plus consumer surplus on dvd which is dollar 300 that is rectangle plus the triangle that is dollar 100 is equal to dollar 400 if the price of the dvd rises to dollar 20 what is the change in consumer surplus if the price rises to dollar 20 the quantity bought decreases to 10 a day you can see in the figure the consumer surplus decreases to you can see the triangle the base is 10 times the height which is 5 that is 25 minus 20 is dollar 25 that is the consumer surplus you can see in the figure which is the green triangle so the consumer surplus decreases by dollar 75 from dollar 100 to dollar 25